This video was recorded in front of a live virtual audience. Hi everybody, Dacov here. Welcome back to the Fashion Bunker. Ooh, check this out. Goody, Goody as charged. Chanel unboxing. We're doing a Chanel unboxing. Actually, it's reflecting the light probably. Let me do a screenshot shocked as a thumbnail. It's just a moment in time, but oh my gosh. I'm going to, this, you guys, I can't, but uh, I had to, <laughs> I shouldn't have, but I had to. And we're going to get to the reasons why in a second. First, subscribe to my channel here on YouTube. Thumb up this video, push the join button next to the subscription button, become a member today, gain access to extra perks. You can also join me on Patreon, Super Dacob, all spelled together on Patreon for extra perks. Thank you to all my members and patrons who have already pledged. This video is being filmed live in front of a virtual audience, so I have my co-unboxers with me. And you too can partake in my live streams every Saturday on my channel. Everybody's invited. So uh, I live stream every Saturday. We do all these videos. We record them together. And then I upload them to, to YouTube later on. So uh, yay. While you're at it, get the Halloween FOMO merch. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. You guys. <sighs> so hefty stuff and i have not unboxed it yet now i've done another unboxing just a short while ago which was also scary to me because i didn't unbox it and i was like and that unboxing chanel unboxing was ordered online on chanel so it was kind of a bit scary this at least i've been to the boutique i've seen what it was and they wrapped it up and now i'm gonna open it with you so there's a couple of things okay so let's get to this Oh, this is so gorgeous, by the way. I don't think I have had... <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't think that I've ever had a black Chanel box like this. Isn't this elegant? So it's mattified black and then with a kind of a lacquered contour. The, the black contouring of it all. So they asked me, Jacob, do you want the white ribbon with the black Chanel or do you want a black ribbon with the white Chanel logo? And I was like, ooh, the best would be a black ribbon with a black Chanel, but they didn't have that. So, so, um, thank you for subscribing, my lovely. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Black on black like this? Love the boxes, VLT. And Debbie says, I like the black. Oh, I love the boxes, CC Spy. Just says, oh, I like the black. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're loving the goth. Jack says, love the goth box. Yeah, it's very... Sh uh, this is as Halloween as Chanel can get. That's true. They're never going to do orange. You just forget about it. I mean, if I were director there, I would make a special black and... Oh, uh, orange. Okay. Orange box with the black Chanel writing and orange, like a gorgeous saturated orange with the black lining like, he like we have here. Black, black, and then the rest orange just for Halloween. That's not that bad. I mean, they did the red Chanel number no. five bottle. If they can do that, they can do the orange box as well. Just saying. So super excited about this. And then here we also have something. So don't don't leave just yet. Okay, so the trick I use for these uh, ribbons, I don't like to kind of just pull them. Sometimes I do, but this one is done so nicely. So I just kind of shift it to the side, <laughs> you know, such a sucker for this stuff. So, uh, and uh, done. Shift it there and then up here. And it's safe all in one piece. So you can just slide it back on. It's a little trick I use. Okay. Gary says, sounds too much like Hermes to me. What do you mean? Imagine if there was a snow globe inside along with your purchase. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, it sounds so much like Hermes if the box were orange. No, it's, it wouldn't. It, oh, oh my gosh. Oh, gifts, gifts. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. I totally forgot about this. Ooh, child. Okay, wait, before we, un before we break the seal, let's go through these together. Oh. 
Oh, they're gorgeous. Okay, let me just... Postcards, you guys. So there's a bunch of them here, but let me just show you. So we got Sycamore and 1957. The print is gorgeously done. Paper. I'm such, a, I'm such a sucker for these things. Wait, I saw number 22 here somewhere. Let me show you 22. And again, 57. Oh, they're like randomly. Okay, so we got number 22. It's like everything is upside down, inside out, twirling, twirling, all about. <laughs> Oh man, these are so cute. What's this one? Hold on, let me see. Oh, we got Mizia. And again, 57. Why are they pushing 57? I want I wanted to get all of them. We got Mizia and again 1957. Damn, why all of these 57s? Okay, anyway, let's get to The little touche are best, says VJ Loves. Yeah, the paper got me excited. Oh, that's super cute, says Penelope. Gustavo is sending hearts. Oh, Gustavo. Mm. Ciao. Shauna says, 1957 is the year my mom was born. LOL. Just says, because 1957 slaps. Gary says, we know we got us when we get excited about paper post oh yeah they we know they got us when we get excited about paper postcards i love but yes yes but this is exciting to me i love the aesthetic and the print is so beautiful i mean i, I like paper in general you guys okay so finally remember i told you at the beginning of the live stream my white powder ran out. It was my tester. I loved it so much that I, I actually got myself a full bottle, a, a full uh, package of it. The Natural Finish Loose Powder. I'm so excited to finally get it. Super Chat from Chummy Vlog. Thank you so much, sweetie. 99 Super Chat from Chummy Vlog. Ah. Uh, it, ooh. Yay, thank you. Big heart to you. Big Chanel heart to you. Check out all of this, the powder, the powderness of it all. So this is the loose powder that I've been using in that little vial this whole time. For a couple of weeks, I've been testing it out. Okay, I just have to peel off the sticker here and then I can start using it. This, this stuff is amazing. It's it's really good. So I highly recommend it. This is a translucent version. It looks white, but it kind of turns into nothing on the skin. It just absorbs the, the fat. So I'm so happy to finally have this without any uh, pearlescent effect, which is the version that I had before from Japan. It had like gave you that pearl look, but it looked like a highlighter. It doesn't work very well for me. I need the one without the highlighter effect. And the second creature is this little baby here yeah look at you guessing look at guys guessing so i'm gonna tell you there's a very specific reason for this ha huh. it is le leon de chanel it really is and let me tell you why last year when i got uh, when Le Leon was released and I was not sure I was going to fall for it, you know, I usually take the little one and then I test and, you know, it, very little goes a very long way. And I use it a lot, but just one spritz is enough. So lately I've been obsessing, so I'm using it a lot more, but it dawned on me. They're watering everything down. This was the first release. 
And I thought to myself, you know, this perfume is so special and actually so good. And now for the first time ever, I'm using it in October because, you know, I bought it for the first time last year, November. So I've been testing it out, living with it now in September, October. It's just so divine. And I thought to myself, this is not a bestseller. This one is not going to, I mean, if it's, it's the newest Les Exclusives fragrance, so they're not going to discontinue it right away. But this one ain't selling well, I'm sure. So they're going to start watering it down <laughs> or the price is going to go up. And I want to have the first release formulation just to stock up. So what I did was I went, <laughs> I went to the beauty boutique. I had my batch code here, which is 5001. The batch codes are usually etched down there. You don't really see it because it's just etched into the glass. But it's 5001. And I I wrote, actually, the store, the Beauty Boutique. And I said to them, hey, guys, do you have batch code 5001 or earlier? And they said no. And I thought, oh, darn. Well, let me go anyway and let me see what batch code they do have. And I guess they didn't understand what my question was because when I came to the beauty boutique and I asked them, could I, could you please open the drawer? They know me. They know I'm a bit cuckoo. They're like, oh, Jacob wants special. Okay, fine. Let's do it. I'm like, please, let's open the drawer. I just want to see Le Leon de Chanel and I want to choose the oldest batch code. And they look at me always like I'm cuckoo, but cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. So they opened the drawer and, uh, you know, they're all flipped upside down so that they can see which perfume they're selling because the name of the perfume is down there. So the lady opens the drawer. She's like, well, what, what do you mean? I'm like, it's black on black. Let me see. And I check and I'm in shock. And why am I in shock? I'm in shock because first of all, they only have three of these. And I got this a year ago. 5001. One year later, they still did not sell out of them. And they are 5001. I have the same exact batch number. It, it's the one I love. So it's my batch code, same production, same year, same month, same everything. And what does this tell us? This tells us that this perfume did not sell. <laughs> For an entire year, this bottle was standing there. Nobody wanted it. Nobody. <laughs> so I immediately, I was so happy. I was like, oh my God. Okay, yes. This is the formulation I want. Why did you tell me you didn't have it? <laughs> you know, but anyway. So, um, so excited about this. And obviously, you know, I'm going to, if I ever start traveling again, this is going to be my little travel bottle. So I'm going to stop using this one and I'm going to start using this one. <laughs> Rich Mitch, that's for me to know. <laughs> How many 5001 have you got? That's a good question. And that's a question I cannot answer right now. <laughs> so, but uh, the beautiful thing about this is that because I, I have already reviewed Le Lion de Chanel, uh, a year ago, and uh, I have to say, now revisiting the perfume, that review falls under first impressions, really. So what I'm announcing here now on my main channel is that on my Essentially Jacob Perfume channel, I will be revisiting Le Leon and I will be giving it another review because certain elements of this fragrance have transpired to me throughout this year that were invisible last year. So um, it warrants this, this beast warrants another, like after one year, another proper in-depth review. So I will be unboxing this one in the review of Lillian de Chanel. And uh, I will be uh, sniffing it, comparing it also to this one, because this one had a year time to get some oxygen in there, you know? So that look forward to that on Essentially Jacob. But let's see what else we got here. So this little bag is also an unboxing. Let's start with this little pouchlet, little pouchlet. 
Um, freebie! Ultimate defining, redefining concentrate. Sublimage l'essence fondamentale. The fundamental essence. I haven't tried this one yet. So, but, you know, I'm loving my um, extract cream, so I don't know. I mean, I'll try it eventually, obviously. And look, we got these little babies here. I was so excited about these because it's very rare to find Jersey in Eau de Parfum. In these, uh, you know, little exclusive four milliliter bottles. Now, this is a pretty old batch because this is a 4201. So this one was made like a year, almost a year before the Le Lyon. So this one is like 2018, early 2019. And then I got Beige, which is a brand new batch. It's 6501. So this just shows you that they give out Beige much more often than they do Jersey. Oh, get your Halloween, a Super Deco merch. Got the FOMO on here, only available until the 31st of October, 2021. Link is in the description down below. You can get it on Amazon, but also on www.superdacob.com. Then, I got this. This, uh, this is an amazing little creature of a thing. Um, they keep surprising you. I ask myself, how does Chanel do this all the time? They, I, who sits there in their offices planning out these products and these freebies because no matter how often you go to Chanel Boutique, no matter how often you go there, and no matter how much they tell you, we gave you whatever we had, still the next time you go there, there's gonna be something that, some freebie that you didn't see, something that it didn't give you, something that was kept for somebody else. It's like so irritating. You can never, ever, ever finish running after everything. And I never knew that this existed. And look at this. Uh, I'm like, what is this, you know? And they're like, oh, this is a little gift for you. I was like, wow, this looks amazing. The box is very sturdy. In fact, it's super hard to open because it's so thick. So, so the Sublimage range. A little collection of towelettes. Aren't they adorable? And yes, these are three different shades. So we got the, um, what is this? One is like black without glitter, one is black with glitter, and one is gold. So this is kind of the shiny black, like with a little bit of a metal thread, gold. And this is black without the metal thread. And then if you open one, they're like face towels. The Sublimage Chanel towels. Um, a little something, something. Isn't it adorable, though? And uh, you got the little logo there, just in case you're thinking, where's the Chanel? There it is. And they're made in Portugal, which is super cool. 100% cotton, You can wa machine washable, made in Europe, Portugal. By the way, it's the same factory that does the cotton for their own collections. Um, remember from the last cruise collection that went on sale this summer? They had a lot of them still left in stock, the little... Um, neckerchiefs and handkerchiefs in white cotton with the embroidery Gabriel on them. Those were all made in Portugal in the same place that makes these. So it's not that it was just sourced out. It is the exactly the, the, the same factory that uh, makes Chanel's own stuff that they sell. So these little tiny towels are super cute. Now, I'll buy their tiny. What are you going to do with them? They're little hand face towels, you know. You warm them up. and But the fact that I like that they're black with gold. It's very, very decadent. It's very gothic, if you think about it. Because we associate Chanel with, you know, this like black and white, but black and gold, it's good, right? Uh, is it a Lotus, asks Debbie. Uh, no, they actually work with the vanilla planifolia. It's the vanilla plant, that because most of the sublimage is, is based on vanilla. So I would think this is the vanilla plant, the vanilla flower. CC Spices, what a beautiful gift, right? Isn't it cute? I mean, it's a tiny little thing, but it's their Sublimage logo. I love it. So thank you so much, Chanel. Now, for all the times that the Chanel, you know, um, fashion boutique is stingy, uh, 
the beauty boutique always comes through and and delivers because <laughs> they're always very kind to me so thank you so much to the beauty boutique team and um i mean i spend a pretty penny there too but still they're amazing they're super sweet super kind super nice people and you and they know how grateful i am and they know for a fact that these things i treasure them and they do watch the video <laughs> so they see also that i like pick up the stuff again one year later so they also know I'm not the type of person who would ever, ever like, oh, you know what? Let me resell this. I treasure this stuff. I put it in my boxes. They're all archived, they're all protected, like my jewels and my treasures. So they all know that I respect this stuff so much. I know they're just freebies and you're going to laugh about it, but it's also the intention that, that matters a lot. And if people really appreciate your business and they appreciate the fact that you're coming back always for more and spending money at a place and if they see that you authentically love a, a brand uh, and then they wish to kind of really thank you in some way and also say hey you're not on any pr list you're paying you're paying for everything you have from this brand uh at least something we can do for you and as a token of our appreciation and they give you little things like this to me it means a lot because it comes from the heart I don't care if this was produced by the brand to give away for free anyway, so you might say whatever. To me, it means a lot because it's the intention behind this that is what is truly precious to me and what I value so much. So when I do get a freebie like this, I'm very, very, very grateful and very humbled. Just saying. So that's that. Oh, of course, I also got a little bit more. Oh, what did they give me here? Oh, yeah. They gave me extra... <laughs> Uh, powder pads because I go through these very quickly and uh, I'm kind of too lazy to wash them so they get kind of dirty so they're like I just take some more because you're gonna use them up really quickly because they know me they know I go through these powder pads like crazy so um, that's that that was the unboxing and I look forward to Leon de Chanel that's a little cliffhanger for y'alls <laughs> on Essentially Deco be sure to check out Essentially Deco my perfume channel Subscribe over there and uh, get yourself a treat, a perfume treat. <laughs> you know, let's talk about perfumes together. So let me read some of your comments. Thumb up this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And bathroom hand towels, KDF says. Yeah, they're a little bit tiny. Vanilla orchid, says Jesus. Very pretty, says Debbie. Thank you. Aisha says, I take the size of towel if I am staying at friends' houses. Nice to dry your face with your own towel rather than theirs. Oh, Aisha, you're that particular. <laughs> I love it. Such nice face towels, says Paris. They're cute, aren't they? And I love the fact that each one is embroidered with a slightly different color. Uh, those face towels are so nice, says Stephanie. I like freebies that are practical. I do too. Paris Ryan, you're... You're, you're a very gracious person, Jacob, says Paris. Thank you. Oh, my God. Too lazy to wash my powder pads, too, says Stephanie. I, I can't wash the powder pads, you guys. Because you wash the powder pad, and fine. And let's, let's, let's just say you wash the powder pad, and it's done. But then you got to let it dry, you know? And that stuff takes forever to dry. Mine looks gross now. I need to get a new one, says Stephanie, the powder pad. Tom says, I love freebies from the beauty boutique. Always useful and special. I agree. CC Spice says, I really enjoyed this unboxing. Ah, thank you, Loretta. I'm glad you stayed up for a little bit longer to watch it. Now you can peacefully go to bed and dream tranquil, serendipitous Chanel dreams. Aisha says, so pleased you got your perfume, Jacob Strange. It was a number five and zero, zero, one message from Coco. I think so. Well, technically, 5001 would be 6. Because you would have to add them up. But if you separate them, you could say it's the number one of the five. She would be all about numerology, too. You know how Coco was. Pixel says, good night, lovelies. Thanks for the great night. Amazing show as always. Jacob, thank you so much, guys. Thank you, Pixel Hexes. So uh, I'm on a Chanel site now looking at scents and makeups as KDF. <laughs> it's the best stuff. You know, Loretta says, I'm off to sleep and dream of Chanel. Good night. Good night. Good night, ZZ Spy. KDF says, great video, Jacob. Thank you so much. It, it, and let me tell you, I appreciate so much all of these lovely people. And they also are really nice to me. And they, you know, bear with me. They're so kind. And they also always tell me, hey, Jacob, you know, you always have interesting stories for us, too, because they know I have a lot of knowledge in this respect. So they like to listen. They're not there, like, saying, like, 
they're like, oh, could you, Dago, could you tell us something about this? <laughs> because I know this stuff, you know, I know it very well. And um, it's going to be fun. Uh, no, uh, it's not over, Alina. Stay tuned, you guys, because this video might be over, but the live stream ain't over yet. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you've enjoyed this lovely unboxing. It was a little bit unexpected. I don't know what got over me. I just needed to get this uh, Lelion de Chanel batch code 5001 secured before it's gone forever. And I just had to do it. It was like one of those unplanned things. It, it just, the bug hit me and I was like, I gotta do this. I gotta do this now because I feel like something is changing and I need to get this before they water it down. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thumb up this video. Follow me on my Chanel Instagram shenanigans. Coco Chanel is in my house, all spelled together. Uh, or um, where you can see my Chanel collection. Or the Coco Chanel Privé, all spelled together, dedicated to Coco's life. Until next time, never forget to never give up on love. Love you all. See you soon. Take care. Bye. Mwah.